Delays 97.1 Amp Radio. It's McCabe. We are backstage at We Can Survive. Now joined by Mac Lamore. How are you? I'm great. How you doing? I'm good. It's good seeing you again. Good Yo. to see you. Um, you're pulling double duty tonight. You just performed with Kesha. Yes. Uh, good old days. Yes. Teaming up and doing that live. How is that for you? Because you don't have to do it that often. Yeah, we've done it. I think that was maybe the third time we've done it. Um, it's fun, man. I, I love Kesha. We have a great time. You know, we're good friends. And it's just fun to be up on stage with someone that you genuinely like. Yes. And, and, you know, it's just that chemistry. We just have we just have a fun time together. Along with Kesha, I mean, it's a night of, of big artists coming together for a great cause. Who else are you excited to see on a night like tonight? Oh, man, I, I love to watch everybody. I know it's kind of like a PC answer, but I think I learned something by watching everyone on stage. So it's been cool to be in the green room and just kind of watch and observe how people interact with the crowd and their moves and, and how they perform. And you have been back on tour, the Gemini tour, uh, for the past couple of weeks. Um, how's it been being back on the road and performing this album? The the response has been crazy. You know, the tours the tour has been sold out. The shows have been insane. People know the words, the songs that we made like two months ago. Uh -huh. It's it's a trip, man. It's a lot of fun. It's it's tough being away from the family. You know, my daughter. But um, you know, I get to see her tomorrow. I get to go home for a week. So this tour was was scheduled nicely. I got a little break in between. You know, speaking of family, and I feel a little hurt. Last time you were here, you didn't share it with me that you were about to have have a a baby mm. um, but I do want to say congratulations mm. and we got you something what um, we can go ahead and see what's in here I'll be surprised as well but let's see here <laughs> okay we got you a green little uh, t-shirt here it's a, if it's a boy damn okay love that love and that if it's a girl we know that you used to work at the zoo uh-huh so this has a bunch of animals on it love that too there you go as well you guys so are so sweet either or you guys just think that i'm gonna have a four-year-old out the jump <laughs> right <laughs> like this is what sloan sloan who's two and a half is in four-year-old clothing uh-huh so this might just immediately go to her okay i might steal this and take credit for it and be like look at what i got you in la you know it's no problem we appreciate it <laughs> thank well, you guys it's yeah, very sweet no problem uh tonight what can we expect from your set here at the hollywood bowl um I'm going to have fun. I'm going to go out there. I'm going to do what I do. I'm going to connect with the crowd. I'm going to turn up. I'm going to run around and, um, you know, play some, play the hits. Are we going to see the Willy Wonka hat? I've been seeing you tweet with the Willy Wonka hat. You know, I'm not playing Willy Wonka tonight. Okay. I didn't know how to get the hat to L.A. <laughs> I was like, I do not want to wear this hat on the plane. I am going to save Willy Wonka for the next time. Is there a special way do you have to transport that hat? Does it have its own like box and case? No, it doesn't, but it needs it. Yeah. Because I just don't want to wear a big orange top hat in LAX. Like that's not <laughs> the move. Well, we appreciate you coming out tonight with the hat or without the hat. Macklemore here at We Can Survive, sold out tonight at the Hollywood Bowl with 97.1 Amp Radio. Stop by anytime you want. Absolutely. Thanks so much, man. Thank you.